Hi, I'm Dr. Andy Thompson, and I'm a rheumatologist. Today, I'm going to talk about non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs, also known as NSAIDs, for the treatment of pain and arthritis. You can visit our website, www.roominfo.com, and print off one of our NSAID pictal pamphlets to follow along with this video. Now, there are a number of different NSAIDs available on the market. Common names you may be familiar with include Advil, Motrin, Aleve, Naprosyn, Indesid, Arthrotec, Volterin, Toradoc, Mobicox, Relafin, Feldine, Sergam, and Clinarone. Each of these NSAIDs is taken differently. Your doctor will tell you how to take your medicine. Now, there are three things you need to do when taking any NSAID. First, keep an eye on your stomach. NSAIDs can irritate the stomach. Let your doctor know or seek medical attention if you have any stomach pain, nausea, or vomiting. If you notice heartburn or indigestion, if you develop black or bloody stools, or if you're vomiting blood or coffee ground material. Second, don't take NSAIDs if you have an allergy to ASA or an allergy to anti-inflammatory medications. And finally, don't take NSAIDs with other NSAIDs and be careful using NSAIDs if you are taking blood thinners like warfarin, which is also known as Coumadin. You should be careful using NSAIDs if you have kidney problems. Please talk to your doctor. NSAIDs can cause an increase in your blood pressure. Your doctor will monitor this. Tell your doctor if you have high blood pressure. NSAIDs can cause swelling of the legs. They can also worsen a condition called congestive heart failure. Tell your doctor if you have congestive heart failure or if you develop leg swelling. Now, patients who've had a recent heart attack or stroke or experienced serious chest pain from heart disease should not take NSAIDs. NSAIDs can also rarely cause a headache, dizziness, or an allergic skin rash. Finally, NSAIDs have not been properly studied in pregnancy. Let your doctor know if you're planning to get pregnant or if you're breastfeeding. If you're taking NSAIDs, you should call your doctor if you feel sick and want to stop, if you're concerned about any side effects, or if you've stopped or want to stop the medication for any reason at all. For NSAIDs, there are other specific reasons to call your doctor. If you develop a rash, if you develop swelling of your legs, if you develop chest pain or shortness of breath, if you develop stomach pain, nausea, vomiting, black or bloody stools, or if you're pregnant or planning to get pregnant. I hope you found this video to be useful. For more information, please refer to our website at www.roominfo.com.